Generic greetings and welcome to Beverage Plus Big Farmer. Today's beverage is... <sighs> That's a Fentiman's Dandelion and Burdock with some ice in it. I don't know why I pointed out the ice. I guess it's nice and warm outside, so I wanted to have a cold beverage. So, um, what am I doing now that it's nice and warm outside? I'm indoors playing a game about making drugs. This is Big Farmer, obviously something I featured as a preview video, and so many people wanted to see this again. In fact, there was many, 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 many calls for a series, but, uh, not too sure about that one. It's not really something you can do a full series on because it's a long game. I mean, I've probably put about 10 hours into the game now. I've probably played yeah, yeah, about 10 hours of the game so far, and this is the second last level on just the easy missions, and then there's another like four or five stages after this, so it's got a lot of legs in it. Oh, the Barclays Spot Zapper has been introduced. Oh, look at them there. I'm the uh, GDC, the Generic Drug Company. I was going to type in Generic Drug Company, but it's just easy, but GDC. I've now unlocked Desert uh, Locations, which is something I didn't show you in the um, in the preview. Like, I'm just going to have a quick look here. This is all my research stuff. I think I'm going to go for advanced processing here and leave it there. Yeah, um, I'm doing the third mission. Sorry, no, it's the fourth mission? Yes, the fourth mission. And I'm doing okay. Look at our little guys uh, little guys and girls working at the machine. They don't actually pull any buttons or anything. They just stand there and now and again they'll write on a clipboard. Just like a tick, yep, that's mid. Tick, yep, that's mid. Tick, yep, that's mid. No quality control in this place at all. We're making um, several drugs. We're actually making a bit of profit as well. Not too bad at all. If we just go to our cures. Sorry, not cute, it was our company. We can see the things we're making. We're making the uh, G GDC uh, pain reliever, which is a painkiller, which is a bit crap, as you can see, curating E. We've got the GC uh, Preg Buster, which is a female contraceptive. It's uh, the Preg Buster. It's a B plus rating. We've um, done. Yeah, quite well on that one, I guess. Yeah, it's probably the most successful thing I've made. Uh, the GEC Snooze Buddy, which alleviates, uh, alleviates insomnia, and that's a C plus, not bad at all. We've got the uh, the the banged what the the bunged zapper, which is an antihistamine. Yeah, not bad. Uh, D rating, so it's not that great. We've got the headache bane, which is uh, is a migraine, but it does induce a little bit of nausea, sadly. But we put it through a creamer, which actually. Um, Helps out with that. If you put stuff through a creamer like that, it um, uh, reduces the uh, the negative strength by, in this case, 60% because I do have a... Oh, let me just get rid of that, and that's also the thing I've been looking for. Uh, it reduces the strength of the negative by whatever percent. So currently I've got a, a level 2 upgrade, so it's currently doing up to 60%, so not bad at all. What else have we got? We also have... I also got a code of cures ingredients. Uh, no, it's company. It's in company tab. Uh, right, we've also got... Got the uh, GDC Gout Stomper, which present gout, but it does give you a little bit of a dry mouth, but I don't think people really care about that one. It's a little bit of a dry mouth. Uh, and the GDC uh, Hypothyroidism Reliever, that gives you a bit of a, a, bit, a bit of urinary retention. So if you've had a lot of beverages like myself, then you can't um, can't go. The Gout Stomper is not very good by the look of it. It's only selling 14. Where is the Gout Stomper? I might have to uh, rip that off the production line. It is there, I believe. Gout Stomper, yeah, it's fluctuating. It is, it's giving me a little bit of profit, but there's a lot of production to go on with that, and it also costs a bit to buy the thing. We might keep it, we might not. Uh, the overall objective of this one, by the way, is to juice, uh, produce 500 painkillers, five, uh, 500 antihistamines, 500 uh, uh, soothe cold symptom treatments, 500 soothe cough treatments, and 500 soothe rash treatments. Now, one of the big problems with the game I found is that... Um, and I did mention this in the preview, it's a bit random what it gives you. So when you start a, a start a game, it might give you the ingredients to do a lot of these or none. And then as you research them more, I'm just going to pause because I don't want to run out of time because it is actually, after all, timed. As you can see, I've got the uh, one month for, before I get the rank of master. I don't even think I'm going to get the standard rank by the look of this one. Um... Yeah, so I've, I've unlocked one, two. You start with these two and then I've researched these other three just to get... The one that I wanted are that four there, which is uh, rubberized uh, mamri bark uh, filings, yeah, and that gives me soothe cold symptoms. But you can see we've got all these other ones, which although I'm making money for, uh, from them, which is quite good, they're not part of the objective. But you could look out and get when you start the game, get um, two of these straight away, which I did to be fair. No, I didn't. No painkiller there, and then antihistamine there. So yeah, I had to research one before I even got another one, and then I've been researching the others and not got any of this, so it's going to be a bit problematic. So that's my soothe cold. Symptoms there that I've just unlocked, so I do need to research more. 
So I've got Soothe Cold Symptoms. If we upgrade that, that have got an antibiotic. So I'm still looking for Soothe Cough and Soothe Rash. So this one is problem with skin. So we can research that one. And that one is psychological. So I don't think that'll be the cough. That one is digestion. That one's in lungs. So if we research that one, we should be okay. What I'm going to do, though, is leave my scientists be. I'm actually going to um, let them give me a bit of... Um, upgrade points because when I get the upgrade points I will then start putting the stuff into here which makes it cheaper because as you can see it does cost a little bit for that so we'll just wait and we'll actually upgrade that there we go right so we need to get the soothe cold symptoms up and running we can remove the causes fatigue which is quite good so we can and then we can level up this uh Soothe cold symptom to maximum and not upgrade it to an antibiotic because that would not fulfill this objective. So let's crack on with that. Actually, let's go to research first and see if there's any scientists doing nothing. We've got one scientist doing nothing. The others are researching or oh, advanced processing to get an autoclave and uh, cryogenic condenser, which are really, really good. We have got a analyzer, which I haven't yet used. Basically, if you shove the analyzer on the end bits here, it will analyze it and tell you the max strength. I don't really care about that. So let's start builderating and where can I build? Well, I could build down here, but it's a bit too far away. I think um, the Sooth Cold Symptom is going to be quite an easy one because if I bring it in there, for example, I only need to remove that bit there which requires a... Uh, Agglomerate or whatever the pellet thing and then I need to level it up one two three four five six seven eight nine So I need four of them basically. Oh, no, no because that that will upgrade itself So three of them should be should be um all I, it's probably all I require. So actually putting it there might not be a bad idea. So let's introduce it there. We'll import the ingredient here. Then we'll bring it along the production line and we'll start shoving it through some of these machines. And this isn't going to be the best layout in the world. And to be fair, I'm very, very bad when it comes to layouts. Let me just move these. The reason I've got these pill things here is because I was originally using them to uh, produce pills before I got a creamer. So let's just connect all of these things here. Connect that there, connect that there, connect that there. Then that should come out with that removed. Hang on. Yep, there we go. So as you can see, this one, it's removing the cause of fatigue as well as upgrading it. So one, two, and now I need to upgrade it a couple two, a couple more times. Yep. Oh! No, 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 no. Cancel, stand, cancel, cancel, cancel. Right. Okay. Upgrading it to an antibiotic, shoving it through that. Yeah, that that upgrades it to an antibiotic. Didn't count on that one, so... I have two choices. I either upgrade it sequentially with um, with evaporators to get it to max strength, or I could use a one of them, doubling the concentration, which sadly I don't have unlocked yet. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cheap out. I'm going to move this over there. By, by, by the way, what I tend to do, if I don't, if I've used something that I don't really want to like, you know, have anymore. I just tend to shove it, um, I shove them out the way because they always come in handy. So, like for example, if I put these uh, there and there now, it means I'm going to save. I basically don't have to buy them again. So we'll move these to there, we'll add them like that, join that up, and like that. There we go. So we now, I know that's the, that's really inefficient. We should have just done it there, but I like the look of it. So we now have a soothe cold symptoms uh, medication. But we can't really upgrade it to the highest strength because it will take too much. Because every time we would we would have to go one, two, three, four, five, six strength. In fact, you know what? We should really find out what the max strength is. Let's do that. So let me go and buy myself a analyzer and shove it there. Okay, and what that's going to do is shove it in there. And then it will burn it, basically, and eventually we'll get the max strength of that thing, and then I'll know where I need to go, and now I'm going to have to name this little bit of drug. So it's the Sniffles Ease, and we're going to get a little bit of cash. And it's giving me 82 profit. That's quite good, though. That's very, very good indeed. But I don't know what the max strength is, so I'll see what the max strength is, and then I might level it up, because if the max strength is halfway, then I might as well level it up. But otherwise, I'll have to use loads of these... Uh, where are the evaporators? There, one of loads of these, which only increase it by one, but it costs seven every time. So if I have to do it, say, five times, that's, like, what, 35? And that's just... Yeah, it's a bit expensive, so we'll see. We'll see what happens when it comes out of this thing. But it does mean we've got our Soothe Cold Symptoms. Let's just go to Ingredients here, see how the research is going, because they're currently in the desert looking for some thirst weed. And, um, oh, we've got a lot of uh, points here, so I'm going to upgrade one of these. That's the most expensive. No, that's the most expensive. Let's reduce it down. And 
we'll have some of these as well because we are researching oh we are we are using that one as well obviously the more discount the better because that will drastically increase your cash if you knock a couple off there we go there's research complete advanced processing so we've got a couple of scientists four of them sitting around doing nothing so we could go for a cryogenic condenser or we could just sit around uh, waiting for this to get sorted. Do I want to do that? Uh, I might just make sure we level this up. You see, we're trying to cheap out, trying to make these things a little bit cheaper, you see, because we do use a lot of them, and obviously reducing it from 26 to 23, and then you times that by 10 all across the factory, then it's a, a big bonus. But um, I guess, actually, we have enough money, really, to hire another scientist. I think it's more... Oh, we could get another pill upgrade. No, we can't because that costs eight. I'm just going to let them sit there and research. Right. Has this thing found... It hasn't found my thing yet. Come on. Find out the max strength, please. Hmm. Oh, max strength is found. Cold symptoms. Ah, oh, actually. So stop. The max strength... The max strength is actually three. And I'm on four. Oh, fantastic! Right, so that was good. That right, that is exactly what I wanted, actually. Obviously, I was I mentioned earlier about having to fire it through loads of stuff and work out what the max strength is and all of this sort of thing, and having to put it through five or six different condensers, or sorry, evaporators, or have it to go through different machines. But the max strength is right at the start. So, do I need to reduce it by one? Current strength seventy-five percent. So if I reduce it by one. That should uh, make it better. Surely. Is that right? I don't know. Let's try it. So it says 75% now, yeah? Max strength 3, current strength 75%. Okay, we need to reduce it by 1. So let's get ourselves a dissolver. Which is really annoying because it's in the wrong area. And shove it in there. It'll come out. Start it up. There we go. Tick, 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 tick. So it's going to go through. Dissolve, dissolve, dissolve. And that is now 100% max strength. That is awesome. That is the best sniffles reliever we are going to find. So, uh, oh, it looks like there's a lot of, uh, look like Barclays. Oh, look at that. Look at Barclays really on my head. Oh, he's got to alleviate erectile dysfunction. Um, uh, cream. Is it cream? Yeah, it's cream, yeah. So it's the Barclay Duration Plus. <laughs> Good grief. Right, okay. So we are now creating... The drugs. Now these should be fantastic, these things. So you can see they're going in. And we will name them. There we go. Cold no more. So they're going to go off. And 91. So that, really, really good. Not bad at all. They're not actually giving me as much money, though. It's not as much money as it was before. But because that's, I'm processing it further, you see. But I could, I guess... Uh, go to here and actually upgrade that, but I am going to upgrade the pill printer to get me more money because obviously I've got pill printers all over the place and Go back to ingredients and see what we can find. Oh, we've just yeah, there we go There's our soothes rash, which is what we need as well. Fantastic. We also need to soothe the cough There's lungs medication. That's what we need, right? So I'm just going to I guess upgrade that twice and then get them in the desert to try and find the lungs one. Right. Looks like anti-season education is going up. So, that is quite good. That, that's quite... See, that, the thing about this analyzer, I didn't really see any use for it at the start, but now it's really good because you can... Say, for example, I'm going to rip that production line off there, yeah? And shove that there. I'm just going to analyze this cream. Now, obviously, that's going to reduce my profits while I'm analyzing that, but it will eventually tell me the max strength, and it means that I can tweak my production line to get the best bang for buck, really. Right, okay, so, fantastic. So we've got our soothe uh, cold symptoms. Now we can do a uh, soothe rash, I believe. So it is soothe rash, which is there. So we only re need, re need to reduce it by one, two, three, I guess. So we will import that. Actually, what I'm going to do, I'm going to not import. I'm going to put that there, and then I'm going to get myself another analyzer and shove it there, okay? And I'm just going to speed up to max speed because I want to find out the max strength of that thing there because I want to make sure that the the rash cream is the best possible um, level. Ah, there you go. Look, you can see I'm actually I'm actually losing money because all I'm doing is bring I'm bringing this stuff in and then burning it. Same as that thing over there. But I do have nearly a hundred thousand, so I don't really care about that one. Right, so. We've got them researching that or looking for the uh, the sand hedgehog. Oh, we've got the max strength of something. Ah, oh, cause of constipation. We found out the max strength of the um, 
my cream, I think. Yeah, my cream. And the hypothyroidism. Yep, that's been found. And the dry's mouth, which is over there. So that causes hypothyroidism there. Let's just have a quick look here. So this cream, we know that causes hypothyroidism. There's also more stuff over here as well. We know that it's actually 75% strength. If we reduce it down by one, it means we actually get the max strength on that. That wouldn't be too bad. We could easily do that. But what I want to do, I am still haven't found the max strength on the others. So let's just keep it going here. Keep the analyzer going. As I said, we've got money not to burn, but we've got money that we can, you know, we've got enough time that we can wait, I guess. Hmm. Right, so, uh, what's my scientist? Four scientists, they're currently having a quick check. I want to upgrade my... There's my urinary infection research, and there's, hopefully, there's the soothe rash treatment as well. That's exactly what I wanted. Right, so, I guess we want to research... Or, do I want to research anything else? Like, unlock? I don't think so. I think I just want to keep the points and um, upgrade things. Right, okay, so, back to production. We can pause it for a second. I always press. I always got to press space to actually do that. Right. So the max strength of this soothe rash is there, which means one, two. That's a fairly easy one, actually. So let's get on with that. I just need to shove that through a dissolver, and then another dissolver there. Again, this is not very efficient, but it gets the job done, which is. What we're trying to do here, we need to get a pill printer because pill printers are actually better than... Pill printer is actually uh, the best at uh, making money, I guess. Creamers only make 30. They just make a standard 30, but pill printers can go up to 32, I believe. Some, it depends on research. Anyway, so there is our nice production line going there, and I'm going to rip, this off the, rip that off there, and I'm going to keep selling the cream while I change the production line, but I just want to check this one here. Looks like we're painkillers okay, antihistamine's fine. Uh, we're still doing our cold symptoms. How are we going? Oh, we're about over halfway now for actually getting this completed, so I don't know if I can actually do this. So we just re reduce it by another one, which will be this. So... Now it's on Soothe's Rash. There we go. It says we can upgrade, but we don't want to do that. Fine. That's our new drug. Excellent. Right. So, this place. So, that is currently on 26% strength. Let's just pause it for a second. So, after researching this thing here, we can see that our GDC Hypothyroidism Reliever Cream, we have it on causes hy uh, cures hypothyroidism, not causes hypothyroidism. Um, we can see that it's on 75% strength. If we reduce it by one, it goes to 100%. It also moves it further away from our urinary uh, retention. Um, downside. We can't really remove that because you do need a cryogenic condenser, which you don't have. So reducing it by one is actually going to work out. So we're going to rip our creamer off, and actually not. What I'm going to do? Bit of a bit of a. I don't know if it's a glitch here, but sadly, if you pull the machines off, the production line doesn't go any further. So if I move that off there, there you go. The production line doesn't move. So what you want to do is keep a machine on there just to get this stuff off the production line to sell it, like so. And then I can rip that off, and then what I can do. I can actually go to basic and then dissolver, and then I'll have to bring it in. Hmm. Move that out the way. Bring that there. Remove that. Put that there. There we go. So that is going to make a different, slightly different cream. I just need to name my new product over there, the rash cream. That's okay. And then that should reduce it by one, which is got it onto max strength. And the other one is now only on a current strength is 61% on the downside there. Has that gone up? Kind of gone up, surely. Either way, we're going to shove it. Oh, no, it hasn't gone up. But when we shove it through this, then it's reduced. There you go, max strength 24 because we shove it through the creamer. And the creamer is, you know, it reduces its uh, max strength. So it's the hyper hyperthymate, and we're going to call that, well, name that there, and that should give us a bit more money. That should be doing better than the other one. I'm just going to go to um, company here, and we're going to check. So we want to get our hyperthymate, and that's a C rating. And what was our other one? Thyroidism reliever, that's a C rating as well. The operating margins are, a bit, yeah, basically I've made it better, but I'm not making as much money. So, uh, yeah, go me. Right, okay, so um, you have to think, you know, is it about making money or is it about curing people's ailments? Right, what else do we need to do? I guess upgrade some of them. No, we don't need to bother with that. Right, so 
back to ingredients. We've got probably nothing else to upgrade yet. Let's well upgrade that, get that cheap, that out a little bit. So we've got a uh, hundred thousand now. One, two, one, two, three, four, five. Is that a hundred thousand somehow? Right. Um. Yeah, hundred thousand. Over a hundred thousand. We haven't really researched this stuff here, as in put it through the uh, machine. This one, this one here, the analyzer. But I don't think I'm going to do that. So. Soothes uh, rash treatments. Let's speed up to max speed here. Soothes rash treatments. Yes, we're getting that done. Soothes cold symptoms. Yes, we're getting that done. Soothes cough symptoms. Hmm. Well, we're not doing that yet, but we are 63% to get the uh, sand hedgehog, which initial reports indicate it is to do with lungs medication, which hopefully will be the cough. I can't imagine what it'll be. That's blood. That's digestion. That's uh, psychological. So I can't imagine it being anything else. So... I guess I might as well start pulling these analyzers in diff different areas and moving it around and analyzing some of my production line. Put that there. And I'll pull that one off. And it means that I can analyze just the one, you see. Will that work? No, sadly that doesn't work. So I'm going to have to do that. There we go. So I'm going to analyze the drugs here. So I want to just find out the max strength of things, you see. Just for something to do while we're... As you can see, my profits just fly straight down. Um, what's our research saying? Oh, nine. We've got nine we can upgrade. That'll reduce its operating cost. That'll reduce its operating cost. I think we've got more of them, so we'll do that. Again, increase our profits slightly. The things will fluctuate with the company and stuff. To be honest, these, are these first ones... Um, these first, like, sort of objectives for the first set of easy missions, it's it's not necessarily about making cash. I mean, the whole game isn't necessarily about making cash, you understand, but um, the th this mission is about making 500 of each, not making the cash, you see. I did have a, I did have a cash problem right at the beginning, but I'm uh, managing to sort this out now. Looks like I'm uh, checking this stuff out while gout medication. You can see Cos's headaches is the max strength there, but the insomnia, I don't know where the max strength is of that. Our ah, there you go. That's not very good. Our prevents gout medication is a bit crap. As you can see, max strength 42. And it's actually got a current strength of... Um, oh, for the dry mouth of 27. Alleviates insomnia is also, I believe, a bit shit. Oh, let me just put it back. I'll just pause a second. Because... Oh, that's a bit of a glitch. I think it's because I've paused it. Oh, that's, that's glitchy. There we go. Oh, oh, there we go, sorting it out now, um, yeah, I guess they're not too bad, that insomnia one, it's not too bad, but it's not great, right, let's remove them, let's actually start selling the thing, so there and there, and we need to put that there, because now we have ingredients for soothing cough, fantastic, so we'll go to the ingredients, there it is, and we're going to import it, and we need to bring it in, say there, because then we've got a lot of space. So, again, all I'm going to do, I'm going to get one of these analyzers, bring it over, and then bring it straight off the bus, like that. You would think that you'd be able to analyze it before you um, do all this, but hey-ho. Right, so we want to upgrade that to level 2, because that gives it a 20% discount, which immediately has helped me out. Because obviously I'm just going to burn this thing. And I might even upgrade the analyzer a little bit to make it a little bit cheaper as well. So it is now um, down to 6 rather than 10, so that's quite good. Is there anything else I need to really upgrade or buy? I could buy the autoclave and the, the cryogenic condenser, but no real point. Hmm. The shaker is... Um, Weird, it, it moves everything down, so, for example, of these things here, it will remove, it'll bring the cause fatigue symptom, I guess, because it's a symptom of the, uh, the bark, down to there, and then it'll move the soothes cold symptoms down to there, so it'll shift all of these down one, which means if you, if you need to, say, shift them down one, if you need to combine these two, for example, you can shift them down one, and then combine the two, it means the cause fatigue won't overwrite the soothes cough, nor will the induced nightmares overwrite the soothes cold symptoms, it means it'll shift it down, 
Then you can bring that over there as the base, which means the uh, cause fatigue, instead of overwriting the Soothe's Cough, would overwrite the Induces Nightmares, and the Soothe's Cold, instead of overwriting Induces Nightmares, would override the Induces Vomiting. So you would get a nice drug which would soothe your cough and soothe your cold symptoms, so it's not bad at all. Alright, there's the max strength of the inflamed skin. We know that now, which is, um, yeah, well, okay, fine. Uh, we just need to get find out what the cough is. I don't know whether it's random. I don't know whether you get um, the negative ones first. I think, I'm pretty sure it's random. How are we doing for this drug over here? 99 operating profit on that one. That's quite, pretty good. That one's that's my best drug. That's my best one ever. Cold no more. That medication there. It's um it's 112. It's it's what it's the best thing I've got in here I think because all we do is we bring it in, we shove it through the uh, the pellety thing, and then we shove it through the dissolver, and then there we go. We've got a hundred strength, like 100 percent strength, sooth cold symptom thing. Not bad at all. Ah, there we go. There's our Sooth Cough uh, max strength. So we know what the max strength of that is now. So it's there. Which is not great because we want to... We don't want to make it induce nightmares. We can't really remove the induces vomiting. So I guess, you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to level up twice and then shove it out. Because uh, I'm just trying to get this one done. So let's speed it up to max speed. They've got ADHD increaser. Right, let us get... Uh, let's remove that. Because we've just reset. Oh, we found the induces vomiting as well. Which means that it's, uh, it's over there. So we need to get this... I reckon there would be ideal. So one, two, three, four, five, six would be the ideal one, I guess. And then we'll have to shove it through a cream. Actually, one, two, three, six, which will bring it to there to activate that one, the inflamed skin. You know what? As I said earlier, it's not about making a decent one here. I need to just get this sorted. So there, it now soothes a cough. Ah, you know what? I, I can't. I, I really want to make it a, de a half decent... Uh, Bit of medication. Let's shift them round. And then we need to up, up it by one. Dissolve it by one. And then I guess shove it through a creamer. I think that'll be about right. Yeah. So. There it is. So, the new drug... Soothes cough, 50% effective, not too bad. Doesn't induce nightmares, doesn't inflame the skin because I reduced it down so it didn't affect on that one. And it's uh, far away from the induces vomiting. And also because I shoved through the cream, it's also 17% strength. So we'll call it a cough away. And there we go, we are now selling it. And that should make us a fairly tidy profit, that one. Yeah, 57, it's not bad at all, that one. And when we start upgrading things, let's upgrade the, uh, the creamer. There we go, which is going to reduce um, the side effect strength to, uh, well by 70% instead of 50. Not bad at all. Um, I think we can... Oh, look at all that. Got a lot of upgrades here. I think I will... Bring that in. And... Actually... Where's the most... What's the, most, what's the one that we... What's the drug we most use? So we've got blue pellets. We've got green chips that crystal thing that one there that one there I guess it would be this gassy stuff okay ingredients um that there we go that should reduce that down and that should increase our profit even further 500 tick not bad we could buy it we could get a loan if we wanted to but there's no real reason to and I think that might be our objective done. So what I'm going to do, because I really need to play catch up on this, we are going to speed this up. We're going to double my production. Which means putting all of this down like so. Like so. And then connecting that up. Ah, I messed that up. Hang on. That goes forward one. That goes forward one. Yep, yeah, let's uh, bring in the... Ah, which one is it? The problem is it shifts it around in there. It is blue pellets. So we want to click on that. 
can pop blue pellets. And then they have a name, but yeah. Uh, not that anyone cares. There we go. So basically, we've copied this production line on that side there. So we're making twice as much because we are very far behind on that one. I'm not going to get the um, within six months, complete within six months for a rank expert. I'm not going to get that one, but I think I'll be able to get the standard. I mean, this is probably about an hour's worth of uh, playing, if not a little bit more in this one. But still, we're doing okay. Uh, we got a bit. Of, we got some cash there. We got eight, oh, we got eight research points rather. Let's upgrade our dissolver to make that a little bit cheaper. I guess we can upgrade... I don't really need anything else. What's these ones here? Planning permission allows you to streamline the approval process by decreasing cost of expanding the factory. See, this is a bit weird because I've normally bought a lot of the stuff by the time I get to that, so... I don't know if it's just me or whether there's a bit of balance issue with the tech tree, but... It uh, looks like we are... Oh, yeah, we're soothing a lot of cough symptoms. Not bad at all. Let's go to ingredients and see if we can cheapen stuff out. I guess... Yeah, we're using that a lot now, so we might as well cheapen that out. Increase our money. Well, we're making loads of money. Let's have a quick look at actually how much money we're making. So, there's us there. I'm going to get rid of all of these because I want to refresh them. There we go. So, that's refreshed. Basically, all of the old stuff is no longer there. There should be a clear all button. Just um, FYI, beta and all that. Right. So, um, our operating margin, 43%. That's all right. What about Barclay Industries? 36%. They suck. Um, actually, no. They're doing better. <laughs> Is that right? Yeah. I've got a lot more cash, though. I'm a profit hire. Oh, because of loan, uh, loan interest. Note. You know what? I'm doing all right. I think I'm doing all right. It's, um, like I said, it's, it's one of those games where... You don't have to be good at it, but it does help. Um, and I, I really wouldn't know, to be honest with you, because I'm not very good at the thing. But um, I am enjoying it, which is the main thing. I haven't actually combined any ingredients for a while. That's the thing. You Normally, you can combine ingredients in the uh, the creamer. No, not the creamer. The uh, the, the multi-mixer from this. Multi-mixer. Haven't done it. <laughs> I just haven't bothered doing it. Um, it is good because you can make like really good, um, really good things, but yeah. I haven't, uh, I haven't really bothered. You look at that. Look at my money fly up as I uh, get that upgrade. Look at that. So that's like giving me an extra twenty, even more. Yeah, about twenty, about twenty thirty. Uh, generic units of currency to tick. That's pretty good. Right. So I think we're getting there, aren't we? So we're soothing rash, soothing rashes. There you go, it's 446. It doesn't sell every tick, you see, because it depends on uh, how many times it goes off, you see. But the uh, the Soothes Cough treatment is uh, doing quite well. Is that right? Or do, does it not update? Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't update per tick, so it, do, it does sell it. That's fine. Um, right, so we've got a bit of money, so I might as well just buy all this um, for reasons. And um, we could just play about. We could just start making random things. Do you want to do that? Why not? Let's see what we can make. See if we can make a really funky drug while well, we've got a bit of cash remaining. So, uh, actually, what am I behind on? Wrath and... Uh, wrath? Wrath? Rash and cough. So I can bring in the cough and the rash and then combine the two. Should we do that? I could do that. Let's do that because it'll be interesting. Right, rash and cough. So we need to bring in them, I guess, down here because it's easier. So, bring in our rash, and bring in the cough, and then we want to combine them. So, how are we going to combine them? It's quite easy, actually, this one. So, we have a multi-mixer, so put a multi-mixer um, there. Bring these in. No, we need to change the base. We don't know what the base is yet, so we'll see. So I don't know. I think one of the arrows is officially the base, but I don't know which one it is yet. Probably the first one to go in. So is that the base? No, the top of the base is up here. So that's going to combine them, which means I have added the cough to that one there. Yes, right. So there you go. Look, it now this cre this this dust that comes out. You can see that if we reduce it by one two, we will get a soothes rash and soothe cough cream. Uh, not cream. We'll make it into a pill. It's going to be amazing. So we'll output that there. We will output that there. 
and then we will go for a pill printer. I haven't got yet. I don't think we can get the uh, the injectors yet. I don't know whether they're in the game. I've seen them in a video, uh, like sort of needles and stuff. But I don't know whether you, they, they're in the game at the moment. Let's bring that out there. Connect that up, and there we are. So that now soothes, <laughs> soothes cough, a hundred percent. Soothes rash, hundred percent. Doesn't give you a dry mouth. Doesn't narrow your pupils. That is what I should have done earlier. But that is awesome. Don't know why I'm getting excited over making some bloody pills. But yeah, there we go. Name that. That is a good drug. I reckon that should, that should be easily B or A. Yeah, I'd say B. B or a B plus. What? Cough, cough, burn, flake punisher. Soothes rashes and coughs. It's only a C. I guess, to be fair... To be fair... I, well, it's yeah. It could so, so that if you've got like a, I don't know why. Why would you take that, doctor? I've got I've got a cough, <coughs> doctor. <coughs> I've got a cough. Oh yeah, got a nasty rash on you there as well. Um, here's some here's a tablet. <laughs> anyway, there you go. Objective complete. So I've managed to get it done before the first of January, twenty three. Fantastic. Leave game. So that is the king of non prescriptions. And we've got three is the magic number. Simultaneous supply three products treating uh, different level two cures within nine years. Not bad. As I said, I've probably played over ten hours of this now, or about ten hours. I've done the challenges for all the tutorial, and then almost these, or almost all these. So I've got master level there, uh, the expert level there, master level there, and obviously the the very basic one there. Um, I don't think I'm going to go back and do these ones to get the master level. I don't really have any interest because there's all of these ones to do anyway, and there's a couple more to be added. So, yeah, having a lot of fun with this. Might uh, have to do another video on that one there. Anyway, there you go. There's a bit of big farmer. I know there was uh, a lot of people interested to see it again, but there you go. Um, I like that that drug at the end, mixing that together. That worked out quite well. Don't know if the actual combinations were that good, but, um, you know, it was a efficient thing, 100% for both, So and it cheapened out my production line. So, yeah, that's what it's about, isn't it? Man, you know, working things out and such. So it is a puzzle game sort of thing after all. Anyway, link's in the description so you can check it out yourself. Thanks very much for watching. Take care, and generic partings.